So imagine you are in a room, <coughs> the room is quite big, and in that room there's all luxury and all whatever you want to do. All the desires can be fulfilled. There are drugs in there, there is the alcohol, which actually we are favorite, favorite drugs, which are favorite of some people. There is the food, seven star food is there. There are women, there are men, most beautiful women are there. And there are cars, there are there's sofa, there's very good bed. Anything which you can think of, the best is there. On the other side, there is Quran lying down on, on, on the cupboard, and there is a prayer mat and place for wudu. And you are as said, you are informed that gentleman or lady, you have three minutes. You have three minutes up to your death. All these players, you can watch the favorite movie or play your favorite game or whatever do zina or whatever is up to you. They are beautiful women, they are beautiful men, they are actually the car, beautiful cars, they are beautiful money, their money, everything is there. You can do, you can eat whatever you want, but there are three minutes only. What would a person do? On one side there is nothing, there is only Quran, prayer mat, place to do wudu. And you are told you only have three minutes now actually, that's it, that's the, your life. So what do you think? majority or all people will go for. What do you think they will go for? The, all these luxuries and pleasures or they will go towards the Quran and praying to Nafal maybe in two minutes or whatever. What do you think? Are you double-minded still? Have you understood? What, what do you think? Which side they should go? Or people will go? They will go towards actually Mat or Budu or Quran. But isn't there attraction? Isn't there beautiful women, the movies, the cars, they are all there. The attraction is still there. But why they go towards other things? Because they know it's only a matter of three minutes. Although yes, we like it very much, we will we'll get it better. Better, we'll get these things better on the other side after our death. So they don't. So same situation is this here now. This dunya is like that room. And all the attractions and the drugs and everything, beauties and attractions are that those like these things. But here you have opportunity to pray and to come closer to Allah. And when you are told it is only three minutes you have compared to day of judgment or anything, that is why the wise people, Ambiya, Awliya, have taught us and the wise people they go for that they know there is attraction there but at the same time they know it's a very limited time what will happen after when the time expires is this so this is the muraqaba or meditation this is what you should think really actually when you feel attracted or sin and one other things okay yes there is attraction but you have allah has promised much better things much better luxuries and pleasures for you in a lawful manner and this is a life of some days. <laughs>